time for Tyler Trash Live. Come on in, trashies. Honey, OJ is gone. The Golden Bachelor is getting divorced. My sh car keys were kidnapped. And is Ricky Martin showing his bird? We've got so much to discuss. Honey, we got. Come on in, trashy. She is on time. Hi, girl. Hey, baby. Hi, my trashy. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Is everything going according to plan? Hi, my trashies. Is this thing on? Hi, my trashies. Hi, baby. Ah, oh, listen, kids, we've got so much to discuss. Also, if anybody's good at witchcraft, send me some good energy because I think somebody's trying to put a hex on me. I'm going to give everybody a chance to come on into the group. Hey, baby. Hi, my trashies. Listen, honey. We've got a lot to get into. Are you guys ready? DM you Ricky Martin's picks. Oh, honey, I got them. We're going to discuss that. Um, OJ's gone. The Gordon Batcher is getting divorced. I mean, can we handle all of this tragedy? And somebody kidnap with a hard P for Pete my car keys. Yes, honey. We're going to get into all this. Um, I just got back from New York City, honey. Hi, Jeffrey. Honey, I'm telling them all about my New York City trip. Jeffrey and I were in New York City together. We saw La Picada Broadway. Broadway show. Uh, you know, it was about that, you know, Madonna uses that painter's pictures in Vogue and Open Your Heart. Madonna loves her as a painter. She's lesbian. And she told her story. It made Jeffrey self cry and it just made me look. But, you know, we're two different women. Come on in, my trashies. Now, listen, please welcome my co-host, Lumina. We have so much to discuss with you tonight. First of all, yes, I just came back from New York, honey, where I did a reading of Messy White Gates. It was everything. Thank you all for coming, my trashies. Honey, I went to New York City, and they had an earthquake and um, an eclipse. Well, honey, when I come to New York, I bring the party, honey. When I lived in L.A., I had a earthquake. And by me to your city, honey, I'll bring a twister. I'll bring um, an inferno. Invite me to your city, my trashies. I love New York City, honey. I had a ball. Come on in, everybody. I'm going to give everybody a chance to come in. Oh, honey, I had a day of it today. And I'm going to tell you guys all about it. But first, um, when I was in New York City, the first day, honey, she just chowed down on pizza. That's why I was. I keep hearing that this, I feel like this chair is going to break. I'm scared. Sean I would blame him if this chair breaks. Honey, I'll bring you a tsunami because I I'm I got wet I'm wet, honey. I bring all the all the her all the um the weather. I'm like storm. Mother Nature, hear my voice. That's whenever I travel, I get on the plane. Mother Nature, hear my call. Let them see my full power. Earthquakes, eclipses, hurricanes. It's fun. You know, when I went to Italy, the Pope died. When I went to Cuba, Fidel Castro died. <laughs> I'm so much fun. Oh, that reminds me. I'm very sweet. Who do you think sweeter? Me or Jonathan Van Ness? Who's the sweetest? Come on, my trashies, vote. They say Jonathan Van Ness, is a, he's causing fear and tension on the Queer Eye set, say sources. Who do you think sweeter? Just look at us. I'll get another picture. Look. You have to vote, my trashies. Who's sweeter? Sweeter, sweeter. Come on, vote. Come on, vote. And then we'll get to Ricky Martin's bird. Let your body sweet. Look how sweet. You know, I'm. You know, even when I get angry, I'm sweet because I came up with this when I'm driving my car in Los Angeles, which I can't do now because my keys have been kidnapped. And we'll get into that. 
But when somebody honks at me and gets aggressive, I just go like this. Honey, because if you can't handle the heat, go back to Sesame Street. I'm sweeter than Jonathan Van Ness. Thank you, my trashies. I am sweeter, right, my trashies? Oh, you can't handle the sweetness. I'll give you a toothache. So anyway, so I'm in New York City and I'm chowing down on pizza the first night. I walk past the um, the old limelight nightclub, which used to be a church and used to be a nightclub. I, hung, I used to party there. One time I hung upside down from the rafters and all my keys and everything fell out of my pocket, which is kind of reminding me what's happening right now in my life. Anyway, so I walk past the limelight and I hear music. I said, is it back on? I walk in there and it's a pizza joint in the limelight. Honey, who is she? <sighs> Honey, they used to do um, Special K and Ecstasy in there. Now they're doing a deep dish and pepperoni. <laughs> New York's changed, honey. But they, but they have eclipses and earthquakes. They wouldn't be like L.A. They wouldn't be like L.A. Anyway, so I go in there and, I, and then I, instead of dancing, I eat another piece of pizza. Uh, it's, a, it's unhinged, honey. Ugh. And then when I was coming back on the plane, um, there was these two kids that eating some disgusting disgusting smelling wraps these two bros like freshman college bros and they and i overheard them they were from brentwood the brentwood bros that's what i call them but they call brentwood the brent Ugh, absolutely disgusting listen okay sean p toast it's disgusting Pizza on the dance floor, please. What kind of pizza would Nancy Grace eat? Oh, God, honey. She probably would like some, like, pineapple and sausage. Pizza Monster. That's a good one, my trashy. I like that. So, anyway, these two bros were on the plane, and they were, like, talking and playing their music. And then this Australian woman on the plane yelled at them, and they put blankets over their heads. Like, they were two dead bodies. And it reminded me of OJ, because... OJ died when I was um, coming back from New York, and that's where the murders happened in Brentwood. And those kids were in Brentwood. You know, Marilyn Monroe died in Brentwood. And now they're calling Brentwood the Brent? No, honey. No. Oriental James Simpson. Dead. Oh. Nancy Grace, honey, she loves to say, bring you bad news. That's why I'm sweet. And Nancy's not. What type of pizza would Lapinka eat? Oh, honey, fish. Seafood, fish, and I would too. Anchovies, salmon, cod, oysters, fish, honey. Ah, oh, Lepicada. I'm still trying to figure out what was her story. Ah, oh, anyway. The Brent, honey. Lepicada, they should have made Lepicada take place in the Brent. Oh, welcome everybody to Total Trash Shop. If you're just joining us, the show's unhinged. I'm also making an announcement pretty soon in the show. And I want you guys all to t stay tuned. I'm having an event here um, in on Instagram Live for Total Trash Live, April 29th. We're having the first Total Trash Live charity ball auction benefit extravaganza. Because I have some of the best tabloids of the last 30 years. My collection cannot be, com you know, competed with. If you don't know, I found all of my tabloids I have been reading since I was a child. And my parents' um, storage unit. And a lot of them were OJ. I mean, look at these. I mean, this is just a fraction of the OJ Simpson tabloids I have. I mean, he, he really was a tabloid queen, honey. She took over and she took over and she took over. I'm not a big fan of her stories. Well, I have some great stuff. Not just, not just um, OJ stuff. And I'm going to be selling it. I'm streamlining my stuff for a benefit. Just like when Princess Diana got rid of her dresses when she divorced Prince Charles. <sighs> I'm leaving my husband. I'm finally leaving my husband. Him. The father of Lumina. We got caught having alien relations. Me and Lumina need money, and we just want to get this weight off our backs. April 29th, it's a charity to help me and Lumina move on and start a new life. It's all with the old and with the new, and I'm going to be selling some really rare tabloids, like Jackie's Diaries. Shh! Meredith Baxter Bernie with a baby. 
secrets of the stars. Lisa Maria Michael. I'm gonna, like I'm not gonna sell everything. I'm just I'm just narrowing it down. I got, it's gonna be a wonderful event, and the charity is for Lumina and Pete. As I left my husband. <sighs> Thank you. And let's get back to the show. Also, yeah, I will be auctioning off Lumina's foot. You can buy it, auction it. I haven't decided. Honey, I'm willing to start chopping up my daughter into pieces in order to move on from my husband. Because I don't care if you're an alien or not. All men are pigs. Now, let's get back to these topics. If you can't stand the heat, get back to Sesame Street. That's what I told my husband. There were three people in this marriage and it was a bit crowded. Yeah, my husband was having an affair. Yeah, and it wasn't with another alien, unfortunately. It was with, um, uh, she, she runs video, she runs self-tape self -tape cameras here in Los Angeles. Anyway, I think she might have stolen my keys. Oh, we have to get into that. Okay, so OJ's gone. We're having an auction. So... My garbage is locked up in my uh, outside of my building because Hollywood is so glamorous. Munchausen by proxy. Well, if I listen, I may have Munchausen by proxy. How we, my trashy. As long as I can get some money out of it. April 29th, be here or be square. We're going to make a, raise a lot of money for me to move on with my life. Anyway, so my garbage is locked outside of my apartment and I have to use the key to throw garbage away because that's how glamorous Hollywood is and people probably want to steal my tabloid trash. So yesterday I threw the garbage away and I went for a walk. I came back an hour later and I didn't have my keys and it had my car fog on it. Well luckily my friend and my trashy Tim had an extra spare of keys because he comes over and watches the cat so I was able to get in the house. But I can't get to my car. So today I couldn't even buy tabloids. I had to walk the streets to get you the latest tabloids. It took me hours and hours and hours. I, re I retraced my steps. I did everything I could to find my keys, but they had been kidnapped. Somebody kidnapped my keys. And I had suspects. Is it the woman that my alien husband's having an affair with? Is it my neighbor Sheila? This is serious. And I didn't fake my own kidnapping of my car keys. So, now I have to like, I don't know what I have to do. <laughs> I don't know what I have to do. What am I supposed to do? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm leaving my husband. And that's all. <laughs> Sheila is back for blood, my trashies. Oh, and then they, you know, they wanted to test OJ's brain to see if he had, C, um, I don't know what that thing is called, CPP problem, C, COPD with the head, when you hit your head too many times. Well, honey, he said, no, thank you. And they cremated her. She didn't care, honey. She was, she was uh, nasty to the end. She was, as Nancy Grace would say. Simpson. Dead. Oh. So... I don't know, my keys are somewhere out there, kidnapped. I mean, somebody can come into my apartment. Last night, I put my, um, I put a chair in front of the door. I put a, a chair and a picture of a zebra in front of the door to block it, because I know someone's going to try to come in and kidnap me. I mean, I could be trafficked. You know people want to traffic me. <laughs> Everyone's trying to traffic me. Uh, I'm like the hottest new thing since La, P La Pica on Broadway. Uh, and my Lumina won't help me. I mean, that's why I'm willing to chop her up for, for money to get out of this. I got to get out of here. Anyway, so, oh, did you guys hear about uh, Ricky Martin's bird? Oh, yes, honey. Ricky Martin's bird. So there's all kind of, Ricky Martin was at the Madonna concert. And you know, hi, my trashies. And, um, and, um, you know, I've been to the Madonna concert three times. So I know it in and out. And the dancers go on stage and they, two, uh, three, two of the boys take their pants off. They have a G-string. They have, um, a, a drop strap and they do um they do things 
erotic dancing. Where is my, um, oh, I have so much notes here. Gosh darn it. This is a catastrophe. I can't, oh, here it is. I have a picture of Ricky Martin. Augie wants to know where you were when you heard about COVID. Oh, my trashy. Well, first of all, um, Jeffrey, my trashy, I knew COVID was happening before everybody else. So um, I, I hunkered down three days. I was ahead of the game by three days. I had already got my, um, ordered my um, air, air purifiers, humidifiers. Um, I already bought a bunch of groceries. That's why there was no toilet paper or frozen food when you went to the grocery store. I took it all, honey. I knew about it three days ahead, ahead of time. So I was counting the days because they said you'll get symptoms in like 14 days. So after 14 days, I said, I don't have it. And I, I made sure nobody else had it. Uh, I mean, I made sure nobody else came near me. And now somebody has stolen my um, keys. So let's get back to Ricky Martin, my trashies. So Ricky Martin was on stage with Madonna during the Vogue Bowl, and the, and the dancers were humping him. And this is a picture. Now they're saying that Ricky Martin's bird got hard. It was trying to fly away. What do you think, my trashies? Some people are saying this is just like a fold. Like, you know, when your pants get bunched up. And some people are saying, this is his bird. And I've done extensive um, analysis. And I'm going to say, this is his bird. This was his bird because it wasn't that bulky. It was a little bit bulky, but when the dancer came, I think it's a combination of both. The truth is always in the middle of my trashies. Yes, and it was the bird. See, so I think it was a little, it was a mixture of baggy pants and a, and a little bit of hard. And a dash of La Pica. With a side of pizza. Oh, there it is, honey. There she goes. Live and Levita bird. Shake your bird, bird. Shake your bird, bird. Shake your bird, bird. Honey, also that Madonna concert is just keeps going and going and going and going. I mean, and she hasn't canceled that one show. Because she's the sweetest. <laughs> you trash. Are you sure you voted me the nicest and the sweetest? I'm the, I'm the sweetest person. I'm the nicest person I know. I'm so sweet. Oh. I took a picture of the Marilyn Monroe's autopsy in people's mailboxes when I was a child. High school. But I'm still the sweetest. Sweeter than Jonathan Van Ness. The queen of mean, whatever. Okay, so um, Essence Magazine's latest issue has sex, sexy men on the cover, and they said ushers, and she's taking a bubble bath. Well, not a bubble bath, just a sort of murky bath. Look, and look at that leg, it's so AI. They added that leg in. <laughs> Whose leg is that, honey? Whose leg? Who's underwater with him? Chance the Rapper? Is that Ricky Martin's bird? You know, I love Usher and I have his autograph. He gave it to me in 1998 when I didn't even ask for it when I worked at Bloomingdale's. But honey, what I really want to show you is, do you like men in panties? I love men in panties. And so does Ricky Martin. That's why he was getting, that's why the, his bird was about to fly away. Because he likes men in panties. Well, I, listen, look, do you, have you ever, the Usher's in his panties. Did you guys see this? It's a skew. Just propped up in his panties. I want to sit like that. I'm so, I want to sit there like all sweet in my panties. You guys want to see a picture of me in my panties at the auction at the Total Trash Live first annual charity auction ball extravaganza benefiting Lumina and Pete. And I'm going to be sitting there in my panties. I can, I can auction off one of my panties. Oh, do you guys want that? This is serious, you guys. Where are my keys? I have a neighbor that coughs in the hallways and she's one of the suspects. Oh, honey, I had to, like, do Mission Impossible and go into my landlord's apartment to see if they left them in the mail spot. I mean, I hate when I lose something. I retrace my steps with this magnifying glass and everything. It is a current mystery that I need to solve. Where are the car keys? It's a skew, honey. It's unhinged. What am I supposed to do now? Walk everywhere? This is L.A., honey. There's no public transportation. Ugh. It's just a mess. It's very much... Very much. It's very much that, my Listen, trash. Okay. Sean P. Comes. Oh, I get it. 
You guys have to support me when I leave my husband. There was three of us in this marriage, and one of them had two heads. An alien. No, no, Jeffrey, I did not leave my car keys at La Picada. I didn't even bring them there. I only brought an earthquake to, to New York. I didn't bring my car keys. Shake, rattle, and roll. Now, we got to get to these tabloids. And, honey, it's about Kate Middleton again, you know. They're still on her case. Um, they're still talking about Kate. Meghan Markle has that new um, upstart that she's trying to make it like a goop. It's called, like, American... Um, <laughs> I have to keep forgetting the name of this thing. American Gardenia at Orchard. Just call it Americana at Brand in Glendale. That outside mall. She, she should just call it that. No, Trash, I didn't leave them at Akbar because I went for, this is yesterday, I went for a walk, a, like a, an hour walk. I got coffee and I came back and they were gone. Yes, yes, Howie, my trash, I'm, we're filing this divorce in Jacksonville because that's where all unhinged marriages are, are aligned. Ah, oh, let's play one of my favorite games. Who is she? Who is she? Who is she? These two celebrity faces were squashed. Who is she? Who is she? Who is she? I'll tell you something, she's not as sweet. Someone's at the door. Hold on one second. Can I get my tea? One moment. Oh, no. Oh, I got so excited. I thought. Wait, I got so excited. I thought somebody brought me my keys. And all they brought me were Amazon Prime packages. Gosh darn it. Vitamins. <sighs> Those keys are gone, honey. They're gone. <sighs> How am I going to get my car? I'm going to have to break into my own car. I'm going to have to steal my own car. Like that woman from Pittsburgh who got arrested from stealing her own car. Because I'm the Swedish. Ugh, anyway, who do we think these ding-dongs were? Oh, also, if you, once I start selling my tabloids, I mean, don't you want to buy this? And I'm going to be selling some of my Madonna collectible magazines. I'm going to streamline. So if you know anybody that wants to collect Madonna magazines, Michael Jackson, Prince, tell them to come. I got this great Whitney Houston one. And a portion of my money, I'm going to open up a school, and it's, it's going to be a school for ding-dongs to educate ding-dongs. Okay, let's get back to this. Well, first of all, what did I even order from Amazon? I always order vitamins. I'm a pill popper. Oh, no, with moisturizer. With SPF. Because of the eclipse. Oh, I looked right at it. And she called me a stupid bitch. Oh, wow, ding dong. I was really excited. I thought my keys were found. When I figure out what the hell happened to the keys, it was probably my, it's probably my soon-to-be ex-husband playing games with me. Lumina, please support me and Lumina as we start our new life, April 20th. Seven o'clock. Yes, honey, Mario Badescu. She's, um, Naomi Campbell uses Mario Badescu. I always use it. Here it is, too. I'm getting verklempt. Let's get back to this. My marriage is over. Who are these ding-dongs? Who do you think they are? It is a hate crime that these aren't in the National Archives, my trashy. I want to open up a library slash dance um, academy and I can, you can peruse all my classic tabloids. Well, the answer to so who these two people are is David Ayelowo and Anna Kendrick. Yes. 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 We did it, Joe. Aren't they cute? All right, my trashies. I'm still trying to get this um, postcard that's hanging in a store in Silver Lake that somebody painted of me. There I am. That's also been kidnapped. I've really been going through it. Also, when I came home today after walking around getting the, the latest tablet because I couldn't drive, I got electrocuted from the refrigerator because I have to unplug my refrigerator to use the air fryer to make lunch. And when I plugged the, um, when I plugged the refrigerator back in, I got shocked. I mean, somebody has put a hex on me. It's probably my ex-husband. My soon-to-be ex-husband, I need all your support, my trashies, during this difficult time. I need all my support during this difficult time, my trashies. You know. I'm going to be walking, it's like I'm walking through landmine fields like Princess Diana. 
I'm going out on my own. I'm leaving the past behind and I'm starting anew because it's a skill. And there's only one thing left to say. Uh, do you think OJ was innocent or guilty? Oriental James Simpson, dead. Oh. AKA OJ, AKA the Jews. Of course he was guilty. You know, but I mean, what do I know? I can't get into that. I, I can't get into that. I got my own problems right now. My work, hi, my trash is just that my work wife Paige is giving a presentation at the Learmark conference tomorrow. Wish her good luck. Good luck, Paige. Yes, we're here for you. Thank you, my Albert, my trashy. Oh, thank you, my trashies. Ah, oh, well, let's get to these tabloids. The latest one. Of course, it's about Kate. Of course, it's about Kate. Oh, honey. Ugh, look at this classic one. Do you want to, would you want to own this? I don't even know if I'm, I, don't, I can't give this up. I, I have to keep that. I can't give that up. I have to keep that. Ugh, it's just too much. Do you want this one? Shh. Honey, American hero who murdered Marilyn Monroe. OJ. They're all just too good. Look, at, I have like tons of OJ ones. Nicole farewell letter fingers OJ. She she said it. She knew. It's all just a lie, honey. More OJ. Look, my Marsha, my OJ trial ordeal. I was seeing a shrink. My hubby was abusing our kids. Oh, I get it, honey. And Martin went berserk. Sally, Jesse, Raphael, the truth about men in my open marriage. Oh, she's probably cheats. Oh, she, that's, that's somebody my husband would cheat on with. Sally, Jesse. Nicole's last Christmas, she threw her legs over OJ's lap and caressed his neck. We're back together. Oh, well. Oprah stung in gem scam. Oh, oh I stole this from her. My horoscope for 1995. <laughs> I wonder what happens. I wonder what's going to happen. These all could be yours. Jackie's Secret Diaries. World exclusive. Leo Harvey Oswald didn't act alone. He worked with OJ. What really happened to Marilyn Monroe? OJ killed him. Her bitter fight with the cheating JFK. He was cheating with OJ. Her deal to marry Ari. OJ. Ugh. Not Hollywood's dementia pandemic. Oh, epidemic. Yeah, God, honey. Because the, the, it's just, it's a lot here. UFOs, buzz, oil rigs. That's because my daughter Lumina is trying to get some money for us. Jen and cat fight. Jen and Julia cat fight explodes. Ew, Clarkson's bad breath racing stink. Her breath stinks. Kelly's diet burned off 40 pounds, but has had a, a foul side effect. Well, it's called Ozempic. Slim down Kelly Clarkson may look great, but sources say the daytime diva starvation diet has left her with a nose scrunching case of bad breath. She's not eating much and working on an empty stomach and has some nasty side effects, particularly bad breath. Well, yeah, because uh, um, Ozempic, won't, she won't eat. A protein diet is good for me anyway. You're eating Ozempic. Her breath also is doing, uh, isn't doing her any favors to find love again. Oh, I hope my breath don't stink. I gotta find a new husband. Kelly looks great and has so much going for her, but this whole issue with her breath is <laughs> since you've been stank. Poor thing. Well, um, Albert, I'll be selling my um, tabloids for different prices starting April 29th. Oh, honey, is she, is she still twirling? I haven't seen her in a while. Justin fears Brit's revenge. Well, he better, honey. Justin begins his tour to promote his new album. He looks like his breath stink. Pop star Justin Timberlake is set to launch his first U.S. tour in five years. Who cares? Sources say he's worried sick that cat calls from ex-pal Britney Spears fans will sink his comeback. They will, honey. Justin's already faced a big backlash over so uh, on social media and a blow to his nice guy reputation. 
Now he's going to put himself out there for public scrutiny, but Britney's coming for honey. Britney's revelations box just into a corner. He's really afraid he's going to be hounded by her fans on his tour. She's sending his fans out on him, honey. Oh, honey, she's unhinged. And whose breath stinks, honey? Hers? Do you think her breath stinks? <sighs> Giddy up, honey. Oh, does her breath stink? My grandpa was a pretty good fella, too. Brit gives Madge the kiss off. What? Let's do this again in about 20 years. Spears next to Madonna reunion. Pop Princess Britney Spears has blown off Pop Queen Madonna's invitation to join her on stage at one of the Material Girls' highly anticipated Los Angeles shows. Considering Britney's ongoing challenges, Madonna understands why she may have chosen not to accept. It's hard to be mad with Britney after all she's been through. Madonna recognized the potential for significant press coverage, and she would have loved to kiss Britney again on stage, but it's not the end of the world if it doesn't happen. Just keep making out with everybody. Honey, make out with her. With Leah Michelle. Does her breath stink? Does her breath stink? UFOs are caught on camera. Oil break images are believed to expose the location of a secret base. In my apartment? I told you this is true. We're gonna get some money out of this out of this earth. Celeb face off. It's Jen versus Julia. They're face off, face on face. Aniston has gone overboard with fillers. But Roberts had subtle work done and it doesn't look drastic. America's sweetheart, Julia Roberts, subtle and strategic nips and tucks are giving Jennifer Aniston a serious case of sour grapes. Julia is quietly boasting she's found a way to turn back the clock without going over the top. She looks fantastic. You can see that she's had a little work on her eyes, but nothing too extreme. Jen's getting trolled for the work she's had done, while Julia's being fed it as the over as the forever young sex symbol. Mary Riley, the Rachel. Oh, it looks like Julia's had Botox to the forehead and upper eyes done. I think Jennifer's got filler to her lower eyelids. That's not sitting well. Oh, this is serious. Oh, what what what, what did she have done? <laughs> uh, help her. Help her. Help me, honey. See, this is why I need to put my um, car keys around my neck. Wow. I'm sure that cougar attack, that's all they do. Oh, honey, this attacked me. I went for a walk at Echo Park Lake and this goose attacked me. Quack, quack. Oh, my daughter, Emily. You're a ding-dong. And finally... Hysterectomy. Ew, special surgery rescues rare two-headed snake. This is disgusting. Rat snake on the mend. Oh, I thought that they put this snake in somebody and, gave, and it gave them a hysterectomy. Well, that's what they should have did. A rare two-headed snake, western, uh, a rare two-headed western rat snake is getting a second chance to slither in the sunshine. Oh, <laughs> no thank you. This, this is my husband. This is my husband who I have to leave. This is who I'm leaving. Look at him. Most men are pigs, but my, head's, my husband's a two-headed snake. I'm so happy that our two-headed gal is getting the care she needs, and we're wishing her a safe and speedy recovery. Oh, she's a woman. She's a lady. And she's a two-headed snake. Oh, she could be a two-headed snake, but is she sweet? Who's sweeter? Who's sweeter? Local Sean Diddy Cubs. <sighs> well, we did it. Lintel James Simpson. Dead. Oh. AKA. Oh, my trashies. So remember, be here um, in two weeks for the first annual Total Trash Live Charity Ball event. It's black tie. I'll be dressed up. Let me know. I'll be dressed up. I'm going to be showing you all around my gorgeous estate. All of my like wonderful wigs will be sold. You know, costumes, Luminous Foot, People Magazines, Entertainment Weeklies, all your favorite celebrities on the cover, Inquirers, Globes, 
Oh, it's going to be uh, the one of the biggest events in, in uh, Hollywood. And it's just for you, my trashies. <laughs> I got to get with my husband. There's nothing about Gypsy Rose, my trashies. Who dies next? Well, that's what I was wondering. What, um, what sports celebrity is going to kill next? Which one's going to kill? Any Coachella updates? Is Beyonce going to surprise? Well, I heard Justin Bieber um, gave a kiss to Will Smith's son, but they were very um, affectionate with each other. I don't know if it's in a homosexual way or in just a sweet way. Mm. Oh, so sweet. <laughs> oh, my trashies. Me and Lamina are starting a new life. I can't wait. <laughs> If an arm has to come off, I'll keep her head. If you want her, you can have her. You got the cash? I got the stash. Woo! And I got the flash. Woo! Ah. Oh. Well, I really thought that that was the keys to my apartment. But just like that, and just like that, it was what Hollywood always gives you. Moisten up. Look good. Ugh. Oh. Mm. Oh, I'm not trafficking my daughter, Trashy. I'm munchausing by proxying her. You gotta do what you gotta do. She's not the only doll that's up for auction. Here's the gem doll. I'm gonna sell her. Kimber. Oh, it's wonderful. You've got streamline in life, just like Princess Diana did when she left Charles. I'm very much like Princess Diana. I'm just as sweet as her. Honey, if you can't take the sweet, go back to Sesame Street. Thank you. Well, that's it, my trashies. I'm leaving my husband, but I'm always here with you. I'll be back April 29th for the first annual Total Trash Live charity ball extravaganza benefiting um, a school for ding-dongs and me and Lumina as we leave our um, her father, my husband, and we start a new life and just streamline. We've got to streamline, honey. Yeah. That's going to be wonderful. You're welcome, my trashies. I love you so much. Does somebody have a car to pick me up? Can somebody pick me up? Ugh. I have to go all the way to um, Westwood Ugh, at 9 o'clock in the morning on Wednesday. How am I going to get there? A helicopter? Oh, no, my trashies. It's a mystery. I got to drive through Brentwood. Nothing good happens in Brentwood, honey. Murders. Maryland, OJ, uh-uh. It's too far in it. Have you ever driven to Brentwood? It's useless. They probably have my keys. You got a Honda? I have a Honda. My trashy. Yeah, and my, um, the, um, I have to tow my car now right by Americana at Brand and Glendale. And they're always so nice to me there. <laughs> Somebody help her. If there's ever been a help her that I've, that we've done before, I need to help. Help her. Help her. Well, you see it in two weeks, my trashies. Oh, speaking of Madonna, I forgot. Did you hear that during the, the Madonna concert in Miami, she stopped the concert and she was mad? Because the air conditioning was turned off. You know, because the air conditioning was turned on. She doesn't like the air conditioning on for her vocals. And she yelled at them and she said, to show her some respect. And then Ricky Martin got his bird hard. Oh, show me some respect. Was I walk away from my husband? Oh. Goodbye, my trashies. On um, April 29th, 7 p.m. I'll see you all again. No, my trashy. Madonna's breath doesn't stink. Neither does my daughter's. We're so sweet. You. Pete and Lumina are so sweet, you can smell our feet. And the birds, they're flying. Usher's in his panties. Ugh. Buy my trashies. It's been trashalicious. <laughs>